All right, guys, Mr. Reeve has been working really hard to get the animal pens finished. As you've seen in some of our videos, we've been chip, chip, chipping away at it. Yep. But I've been inside baking all day, and he tells me it's ready, <laughs> right? <laughs> he tells me it's ready for the reveal. So you guys get to see it the same time I do. That's right. I'm ready for inspection, boss lady. Oh, I don't know about inspection. It'll be <laughs> wonderful, I'm sure. Ready? Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. I got most of the mess out of here. Most of the mess. Oh, yay. No barbecue. Oh, my gosh. No barbecue. No. Oh. <laughs> That's why yeah. you looked over but, there. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Just it's... Tunnel vision, honey. Tunnel okay, vision. Okay, sorry. I'm sorry. Go. Oh. Sorry. Oh, my gosh. Okay. First, let's check in with the boys. We'll see how they like their new digs. Yeah. Boys. They only escaped once so far. You're sleeping on your food. Hanzo. Cooper. You guys are being lazy bums. Yeah, apparently it's nap time, I guess. Is it goat nap time? <laughs> the boys have all this space. Hi, Cooper. Yeah. This is good. Now I can rub no, it on please mom. don't touch me. No, my so many of my jackets smell like you already. But I do love you. I need like a stick to scratch you with. Oh, I know. Here, I can wash my hands good. Oh yeah. <laughs> You're such a weirdo. I love you. Let's go see how Hansel's doing. No, don't lick my hands no more. Hansel, Hansel! There's my handsome boy. There's my handsome Hansel. Yeah. Say I don't smell that bad. I don't smell that bad. Only Cooper. Yeah, yeah. I know, Cooper. I love you too, buddy. <laughs> Smells real bad in here. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, extra goat smell. Ooh. Guess what? Good you thing. You didn't latch the gate. No, good thing you're the, what do they call it? The sentry? Where you like guard the gate? <laughs> I know, apparently. Why are you eating my gloves? Cooper, I love you. Ooh, just at a distance. Yeah. I know. I wish it. Nope, nope. You, you get done smelling like a boy, and then we can be closer buddies, okay? <laughs> Maybe I'll give you a bath this spring. What do you think? Yeah? <laughs> You're a weirdo. Here, smell my hand. Yeah? <laughs> it smells so bad. <laughs> You're used to it, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, well, I've been me. out here working next to them all day. I know. I love you. You smell like a goat sometimes. Especially <laughs> yeah. when you pet Gooper, huh? I try to only pet him back end. Pet him on the back end. Right? The back half. Yeah, tell people why you're not supposed to pet a boy goat's face. Well, you if you don't, don't want to stink. Yeah, you don't want to pet a boy goat's face because they will pee on themselves. Because that is somehow attractive to the ladies. Yeah, they pee on their foreheads. Yes, they will pee yes, right on their face. Weirdos. They are very... Hey, give me my gloves back. Yeah. All right, keep showing me around. What's next? You want to see why I was next door to him? Why you were next door? Why I was next door to the goaties. Yeah. All right, let's see. All right, so next door to the goaties, we have the bird. What do you call that thing? The A aviary? Aviary, that. That's I can't. Only for birds that fly. Oh. Well, that's why I have a tall gate, because we do have birds that fly. Yeah, Miss Houdini. Miss Houdini. Yeah, she can get out of anything. I clipped her wings, so oh, she's sad did now. Did you? Good. Yeah. She was roosting on my side mirror the other day. She was on top for, for y'all that have watched the channel and you noted that they were sitting in that um, Amazon greenhouse for their coop. We came out in the morning and she was on top of that guy. She, yeah, she's crazy. Yeah, she's... She can get out of anything. She's yeah. a goat. She's a goat. She's the goat chicken. Not anymore. All right, show me, show me what's next. Next door to the goats. Okay. Are you coming, Days? Yeah, what do you think? All your friends in one place, huh, girl? Immediately next door to the goaties. Yes. We have a little goose house. Oh, look Hopefully at Hopefully they will use it. Yeah, that's an old mushing dog house. Yep, I took the legs off and extended the door oh, all the yeah. way down. So they can go in there. So they can go in there a little bit easier. Good. Reduce, Never reuse, mind. recycle. I still have my tools right there. I noticed that there's a nicely um, coiled and fashioned uh, ratchet strap there. Yeah, just like you just like you left it. Oh no. Oh no, they watched me coil it up and put it nicely down. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. That that is a Mr. Reeve ratchet. No, actually it's not. Oh. That's how what it looked like after I saved it from Oh no. from Daisy. Oh, Daisy. Cuz I was working and something orange went by. <laughs> <laughs> Daisy, are you getting into trouble?
trouble. That never happens. It never happens, girl. I don't believe it. Daddy's fibbing. Yep, she's an angel. Yeah. Next door to the geesers. Geesers. Oh, wow. Chickens. Chickens. They got hay. It'll oh, be all set. Oh, they're going to be so happy in here. So happy. And you say, but Mr. Reeve, it's just going to be invaded by the geese. Uh, but Mr. Reeve, it's just going to be invaded by the geese. Oh, nay, nay. Oh, nay, nay. So, oh, my. There's a little pothole door oh that's my. not quite big enough for the Gosh, geese. Daisy could go in there. Can Daisy get in there? I don't know. Probably. probably. Oh my gosh, I love it. You did such a good job making a chicken pothole door. I don't know. It's pretty cheesy. That's perfect. It's perfect. Cut off a plank and rip. It's awesome. Now, after the chickens have gone to roost tonight, I'll catch them all up and bring them in here as well as the geese. Bye bye. We still don't know if Daisy will fit in there. I know. Go in there, girl. Daisy, there's probably snacks in there. <laughs> no. Nope. She just wants you. You want to go in there, girl? No? You just want to sniff my camera? Hey, I know. You know? Yeah, I know. Uh-oh. Oh, oh yeah. you're smart. Mr. Reeve. Daisy. The ultimate bait. <laughs> Come on. Come on, girl. You coming? Oh, good, good girl. girl. Good girl. <laughs> Was your daddy in there? Yeah. Good girl. All right, let's go. Come on. So we have the geese and then the chickens next door, yep. but they're sharing a run. They're sharing a run. This is a really nice size run for chickens that aren't going to come out in the winter. Yeah. It's beautiful. Sweet. Yeah. I think this, I think this is going to work out pretty good. Yeah. Awesome. So we should uh, let people in on the, uh, what the weird noises are coming from behind you maybe, huh? <laughs> yes. I'm like, what are you talking about? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not me. <laughs> it was the dog. Are you coming, Daisy? Yeah? Okay, good. Come on, girl. You ready? Daisy in there, Holly in there. All the animals. Come on, girls. Good girls. Good girls. Yeah, good girls. Hi, Holly. Yeah, you been a good girl. It was actually the goats. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. Sorry, we're not listening to you at all. We're looking at a cute dog. Cute puppers. Cute puppers. Okay. It's understandable. <laughs> what were you saying? Sorry. We reused the goat gate. Oh, we did. Goat gate. Yeah, that's great. Now, during our gate episode, we built a four-foot gate that I was going to use in here. And then we found... Miss Houdini's sitting on top of the chicken coop over there. So we thought, hmm, better make a little bit taller gate. <laughs> She's stealing your show. She, she I is love completely you. sure that you have cookies in your no, pocket. No, I something. smell like a goat, girl. I don't want to pet you with that hand. And then you'll smell like a goat. Yeah, I got to wash my hand. Oh, my gosh. I love you. Cool. She's a good girl. So. What's all the snorting and <laughs> behind me? Yeah, that was a pretty good impersonation. I did pretty good. I could talk to him. Piggos. Piggos. There's Porcini. And He's getting pretty big. the girls. You know, I could probably pet the pigs because my hand can't smell any worse than it does now. <laughs> <laughs> That's probably not a challenge that you want to throw out there on the farm. See if I can make it smell Can't worse. smell any worse than it does now. Right? Oh, nope. Open the way. Yep. I always get that mixed up when I walk into places where you push or pull the door. So all, aye, the, aye, aye. all my gates from now on will open out. All your gates will open out? Out. And here's why. Because in the winter, when we get a big, huge dump of snow, if the gates open in, I can't clear the snow before I go through the gate. And so I have to push the snow with the gate. So oh. if all the gates open out, I can clear the snow before I walk through the gate. Oh, see, I know you're smart. Oh, I never thought about that. I didn't either until I had to <laughs> fight it. Are you fighting it all? <laughs> yeah. Hey, girls. What you got, huh? 
Oh, there's my buddies. There's my buddies. Yeah, there's my good girls. Oh, yeah. Yeah? You want some pets? No? You're busy eating spent grain? All right, I'll let you be. Oh, you changed your mind? Huh? You changed your mind? Oh. You want to get petted? Oh, hi, girl. Hi, girl. Yeah. Oh, there's a good girl. There's a good girl. Yeah. What's she happening, Jace? She's a big girl. Huh? She is a big girl. Yeah. She's happy. Poor Jeannie. What you doing? Yeah, hi. Oh, you're still a sweet boy. Yeah, oh, you're still a sweet boy, aren't you? Yes, you are. Yeah, good boy. <laughs> Juniper's trying to figure out how she can get in here and get the pig's food. Pretty soon she'll realize she can just jump up on top of their house, but she don't know that yet. So this Gigantor pig hut that we have, we actually got donated from a friend of ours a few years ago. Yeah. We didn't use it last year, but this year I decided to go down the hill and fetch it with the tractor. It's very heavy, but yeah. the pigos love it. You just pack that guy full of hay and they... They do love it. They don't need yeah. a door or anything. They stay so warm in there. Yeah, they just go curl up and cuddle up together and they bury themselves in the hay and yeah. You want to tell people how we cut our snow machine trailer on fire trying to bring this home? <laughs> Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, oh, I did no. not forget. I was a little traumatized. Yeah, so if you have heavy things to haul, don't use a lightweight trailer. We uh, <laughs> put this thing on our two-place snow machine trailer, and it smashed the springs flat, and so the wheels, the tires were rubbing oh. against the underside of the trailer, and we didn't notice that until the underside of the trailer started smoking. So yeah. we weren't very far either. <laughs> no, I think we made it like a mile. A down mile, the road. and I'm like, um, the trailer's smoking. The girls think they hear something. Yeah, what do you think, girls? Yeah, you're protecting the farm. Good girls. Good girls. Yeah. And last, we have the girl goats pen. The ladies. The ladies. Look out, ladies! We're coming in. Hi, Miss Willow. Hi, girls. Oh, my goodness. They think I have snacks as Gretel. Huh, Lucy, look how big you are, girl. Yeah. And Sage. Huh. And Willow. Hi, beautiful Willow. Yeah. Hi, honey. Hi, honey. Yeah. Hi, girl. And Fireweed. Huh, girl. Yeah. Who is left here? Oh, where's Bernie at? Oh, Roca! Roca is such a sweet girl. <laughs> Fernie! She's busy, she's hungry. This is Fernie, she's last year's baby. She's like, I'm eating, let me be. Hi, Fernie. Oh, you wanna be petted, Miss Lucy? Okay, okay, good girl. Oh, look at you got him a little hay feeder thing. Oh, I've become a scratching post. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let me guess, Gretel. Yep. Gretel! Dude, you could do like cellulite massage. You could make money on this is. deal. Keep going, girl. Keep going. <laughs> it's where like people have this idea that they can like break up the cellulite fat that you have by like super massaging, massaging it. it. Yeah. You are crazy, but I love oh, you. She loves you. <laughs> She's strong, dude. Yeah, I know. She's like whipping me over here, dude. And over here in the sheds that y'all watched us build, we have little houses for them. <laughs> Sorry, it's wobbly because yeah. Gretel's whipping my butt over here, dude. <laughs> Gretel! Okay, Gretel, I love you. Yeah, that's enough, girl. No, that's enough. That's enough, girl. That's enough. Okay. Quick. What? Quick. She's taking a break. <laughs> no, she's not. She's coming <laughs> after me again. So inside Shelters. our big shed, we've got some little goat houses. Yeah. Now the shed is going to keep the snow off of them and the wind off of them and their little houses are where they'll go. They'll cuddle up and use their body heat and stay warm and they actually love it. You'll see it when it's cold in the winter time. They'll just poke their heads out and watch you go by. Yeah, they need their winter buddies. Yep, so we have these two huts and then there will be a, pl a platform across the top making this inside here the third hut. Yep, and we'll fill it full of hay. And we'll fill it full of hay. And then the goats, they like to be up tall anyways. So. Yeah, they'll probably jump up on top of it. They'll a bunch, probably sleep so. up there, yeah. yeah. And then we do have one modification. 
Um, a lovely viewer told us that she had built a similar structure, um, but that the sheet metal on the side here, um, we need to connect it to that board down there because she had a goat that shoved her foot through there, two goats, I think, um, and they got hurt. Yeah, so we're going to take so. a two by four and put it across there yeah. and get that screwed in tight. So thank you for that tip. Yeah, yeah. Keep sending yeah. your suggestions for sure. Yes, we absolutely. appreciate it. Cool. Look how much room these girls have. And nobody's escaped yet? Nope, not yet. No escapees. No escapees. Bye bye. So what's left? What's left is the piece de resistance. Oh, I'm confused. <laughs> the one for me. You're getting a shed? You're my sleeping pen. outside? My your pen. pen? Yeah. Um, very confused. Honey, you've never been in that much trouble in your life. Come on, I'll show you. Okay. All right. Bye, girls. I love you. Quick, before they yeah. run out. Oh. Ooh. Yeah. They Sorry. know that snacks come from this side of the fence. That's why they're nice to me. Because <laughs> I bring crackers and prunes. Okay. Oh. You are standing in. I'm standing in. Mr. Reeves' pen. Mr. Reeves' pen. This is the most important pen. Okay. Because <laughs> now I can feed all the critters from this one lane. Oh, yeah. And I can take all the snow from their little runs, throw it in here, and then snow blow it with the tractor right into the garden. So this is going to make my life in the winter way easier. Yeah. It's kind of the lessons that I learned from having them in the to be Lake of Sadness last winter was oh, yeah. having a center lane is wonderful. Yeah, very important. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, and then I'm not running all over the farm just to do my chores twice a day. Right, and it takes so much time when you're shoveling all that snow. Yeah, and show them how close the house is. Ta -da! Ta -da! Close enough to smell Cooper and to hear Teddy. Oh, I thought you were going to say to smell me. No. <laughs> That's inevitable. I'm stuck with that deal. Sorry, honey. No. <laughs> I'm just teasing. And this is going to be my saving grace this winter. Bye-bye. We finally got a walk-behind snowblower that I can get this inside each one of those pens and blow the snow out to the center and then blow all that into the, into the garden. And the Connex here behind me, we plan to use that as our feed shed for the winter. So everything's in one place. Yep. And these are areas we normally keep clear between the connex and the driveway and stuff, so it's not extra work for you. Yeah, exactly. That's awesome. So wish us luck that all of our winter plans actually work and we don't end up with another <laughs> lake of sadness. Right. <laughs> and stay tuned. We'll see you on the next video. You did an awesome job, honey. Thanks, love. I've been busy. You want to come in and try muffins? Ooh, that sounds perfect. Bye -bye.